Tempo tissues start out as a giant roll of cellulose. Then it has to be processed down to size to produce tissues in a practical, small format so that people can blow their noses conveniently. Ewald Spurre, a factory manager at the Tempo plant in Neuss near Dusseldorf, would probably love to just sell giant rolls of paper to the public. But he knows the product has to be carefully tailored to suit the needs of the discerning customer. He has one technical problem. It's a conflict because if you make them very soft, then they usually aren't very strong. And if you make them very strong, then they usually aren't very soft. You have to find a certain compromise. Things were different in the old days. Oskar Rosenfelder filed for a patent for the throwaway handkerchief 80 years ago and founded the Tempo Company. In 1933, the Jewish entrepreneur left Germany to escape the Nazis. The patent remained in Nazi Germany and later in the Federal Republic of Germany. Until 1994, Tempo belonged to the Schickedanz Company. Then the American chemical giant Procter & Gamble bought it. The machines continue turning in the state of North Rhine-Westphalia. Ewald Spurre has to use them efficiently because while overall demand for tissues remains relatively constant, the number of cheap competitors is always increasing. How does the company remain competitive? Is it all a matter of packaging? I think it's kommt immer noch auf the market niche. I think it's a matter of the market niche. We introduced tissues in boxes into new markets where they weren't so established. And there are growing markets in Eastern Europe, where using paper handkerchiefs is not common yet. I think there's still room to increase revenues and develop. On the streets of Neuss, the old battle between cloth handkerchiefs and disposables is still undecided. Uh -huh. And it doesn't bother you to have to wash it? Why? Ask the young people. No, you throw it in the washing machine and you iron it along with everything else. I have both. It depends. If I'm working in the kitchen, paper tissues are fast. But if I go out, then I use a pretty handkerchief with lace. Really? How would it look if you're all dressed up and take out a paper tissue? It's not suitable. Nine million packs a day, 20 billion individual tempos a year. These are record figures that haven't fallen in years. Tempo now claims its product can withstand the strongest sneezes. And the lab is constantly improving softness, too. Spurre and his crew even got rid of the rough decorative margins. This is a it's characteristic of Tempo tissues that the embossing is different from other brands. We don't have such rough surfaces as in this example. Tempo is now Swedish owned. About 500 employees have their fingers crossed for the latest product, eucalyptus scented tissues. <laughs>